This is a hearing direct review of the Amplicom's Bigtel 2OT twin set phones. As you can clearly see, these are sold uh, as a pre-boxed combined twin set or pair of telephones. Uh, you can see that we have uh, two base units here and here and the two handsets. You will see that there is a difference between the two base units. In the case of this one, you can see that there is a, a cable pre-attached pre to the back of the base unit and in this case the uh, cable is inside the box and that actually uh, does need require, uh, require plugging into the power socket. The difference between the two is that this is the base unit, this one here, the larger one, uh, and this is the one that must be connected to the telephone socket, um, whereas this one can be placed anywhere else in the property uh, once this one has been um, set up. Uh, and clearly the two will then um, communi communicate with each other. Um, so some of the features of the, the Amplicom's Bigtel 202. Um, it's uh, a very good price. Um, it's the budget range, if you like, from the Amplicom's brand. Um, it does have good size buttons and good size screen. Um, it has amplification up to 30 decibels. Um, which is about middle of the range in terms of um, maximum levels of amplification available on cordless phones. The most powerful go up to around 40 decibels, which um, although only 10 decibels more and sounds like only a third more again, um, the decibel scale being logarithmic rather than linear, uh, they are considerably louder. So uh, there certainly are more powerful phones on the market, but these are a good price and they are, uh, do deliver a good uh, degree of clarity. A few of the features of the phone, um, when we're looking at the handset, you can see up here there is an M1 and an M2, which are the uh, speed dial buttons, so you can program certain uh, members of the phone book can be allocated one of these two speed dial buttons for ease and convenience of quick dialing. Um, both handsets are hearing aid compatible, so if you are using a hearing aid in its telecoil program, then either of the two handsets will, when placed in reasonable proximity to the hearing aid, will communicate directly to the hearing aid and their volume that they play the sound at will be dictated by the setting within the hearing aid. Um, they, they, phones that suit themselves have um, a phone book built into them, so you can store multiple numbers and names of uh, uh, friends and family, and those are, are accessible through the up and down arrows here, having first selected the, the phone book. Um, both handsets also come with a speaker phone, so they can be used in a hands-free fashion. Um, so if you wanted to activate that when the call comes in, you would be pressing the green button to answer the call, um, which would then activate the, this part of the phone to be able to hear through and obviously speak through here. However, if you press the button again with a live call, uh, it will then in fact activate, deactivate here um, from, a, uh, and, uh, from a point of view of, of holding up to your ear and it will uh, set the phone into its speakerphone mode so that the phone can then be used without uh, your hands and placed on a table, for example. Just looking at the side of the phone here, you can see a volume control here, which is plus or minus. Um, this is the uh, um, handset ringer, so you can hear the handset actually ring as well as the base unit. Um, uh, this is a battery compartment here. And then on this side, you have the boost button. And the way the boost button works is that effectively what you need to do is press the boost button to set the phone to being capable of a maximum level of amplification. Once set, you would then increase the volume to maximum to get the maximum output of the phone, which is, you can see is written here, is 30 decibels. And you can see also on here, 30 decibels. And that's what turns the phone into maximum volume mode. Um, just a few uh, more uh, aspects as regards to the uh, phone's performance. Um, you've got uh, an ability to page the phone here in case you aren't sure as to where the uh, handset is located. And the final thing to mention about this twin set, as is true for many, um, the great advantage of buying them as a twin set like this, rather than as individual items, which can be done, uh, the twin set will come pre-paired. So effectively all you need to do is to plug this into the phone socket and the power socket, 
and plug this one into just a power socket and the phones will be ready, paired and, and, and ready to go. Um, so all in all, we, we love this phone, we sell an awful lot of this particular twin set. Um, it's good value, uh, it's got a good level of amplification um, and a good set of features but not too complicated. Um, but if you'd like to know more about the Amplicom's Bigtel 20T or any of the phones at Hearing Direct, then please do call one of our experts on 0800 032 1301 during the normal working week 9 till 5 or outside those hours you can email us at customer services at hearingdirect.com.